Hi, this is Richard Byrne, and in this video we're going to take a look at how your students can use Google Drawings to create a fake Facebook profile for historical characters or for fictitious characters featured in literary works. So this template was developed by Derek Waddell, and we'll go ahead and select Use This Template. This is available in the Google Docs Template Gallery. So we'll use that template. By the way, I'll link this template in the footnotes for this video and now we have the template loading here and really we just need to follow the directions that are on the left hand side here of course you can modify these directions to fit the needs of your classroom let's start by putting in a profile picture so I'll just click on photo not available and then hit the delete key and remove it and now I'm going to insert an image and I can pull an image that saves in my Google Drive account or any other part of my Google account or I can upload an image so let's say I'm going to use my dog Max and Max's picture will be featured here. Now this is huge so let's just click on the picture once and shrink it down to the size we need. Move it over into the box. Make it a little bit smaller even. There it is. Perfect. Now because this is in Google Drawings you could further customize that image if you needed to. Uh, you can go ahead and crop the image. You could put a mask around the image. Maybe you want to make a nice rounded edge around it. You can certainly do that. Okay. Now to fill in the rest of the profile, we're basically just going to insert text boxes throughout the template. So I'm going to fill in the name up here on line two. To do that, let's use text box. Let's draw in the text box. And we'll say Max the dog. Now the neat thing about this, because it is in Google Drawings, you could use custom fonts. So you could go in and say I want to use the uh, bitter font instead of the standard Arial font. You can change the font's color, make it bold, or italicize it if you want to. And so my profile is now Max the dog. Now down here on this section for travel pod, if you wanted to put in where in the world this person has been, uh, a couple ways we can do this, but probably the easiest way to do this is to just draw in an arrow for where in the world this person has been or where in the world they, they live or lived. So to do that, I'm just going to use the drawing tool. I'm going to say select the line and put in an arrow. And let's draw in an arrow to where that person lived. And so I have that arrow now, and I want to make that arrow stand out a bit. So let's go ahead and change the line weight. Now that's a little bit too big, so it's there. That's perfect. And we can change the color of that line, make it stand out as well. So when you're done filling in this profile, you can go to the File menu, and you can have your students download it as a PDF or a JPEG or PNG image. Or, of course, they could just share it to you over here just like they would share any other Google Drive item. Let's put in an email address. We'll share it to Max and send it out. So that's how you can create a fake, fake, fake Facebook profile. And for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com.